All right, what's going on guys? I feel like it's been a long time, aside from the wheelie tutorial I tried to make that, since I've really like gave a good old like moto vloggy-ish type of video, you know? I've been wanting to do a video lately where I see how long I can wheelie, but when I had a really good chance yesterday, my GoPro was freaking dead. Oh, that was suck. I thought I saw a speed bump for a second, so I stood up a little bit so I could see. And I, uh, I also kind of never mentioned that I learned knee knockers either. I just kind of learned them one day and I was going to do something with it, but lot footage is just boring, man. I don't, I don't mind a lot video every once in a while, but I don't want to do, you know, because lot videos, it's just back and forth in the same space. It all looks the same. Every wheelie looks like it could be a repeated wheelie, even if it's different. I just don't, I don't want to post videos at least not very often that are just lot videos so I ended up never doing anything with the footage of me learning the the knee knockers I'm still working on them I can kind of like hover between balance point with it maybe dip back but for the most part I feel like I kind of chase it right under balance point or like can't hold it at balance point good enough to where I keep having to chase it and like slowly speed up and I don't know they're not as one is the sit downs but it is nice to see where I'm going when I wheelie so I might do a couple while we're going around here too been doing a little bit more third gear wheelies too because second gear just has so much engine brake and uh Rendon said it might be because I have my catalytic converter and um I still have like all the honeycomb stuff in my headers or whatever I guess I've been trying to use third gear a little bit more so I can have less engine brake and some smoother wheelies. See, third gear just chilling. Gotta stay in my lane though. Now we're drifting. See, and I can't put it down as good as I want to. the knee knocker on the street. <laughs> Guess when knee knocker's not too bad after all. Yeah, lately I've been uh on the street I've been going less for the dips and more for the distance because I'd rather dip in the lot because I don't want to slow down so much that I like if I'm coming up to a red light I could probably do some dipping wheelies but I don't really want to slow down the people behind me uh, at least I try not to because here in Texas people don't want to wait on you and go slow <laughs> Glad that car didn't go in front of me because that would have been a fucking wreck. Imagine, bro. That's that's the danger with wheelies out here. Even if you're good. mind the scream guys it's all under control all right we have made it through the brick path on a couple other paths they redid this road I forgot about that I'm gonna see how long I can wheelie <laughs>
So, uh, yeah. <laughs> I don't know what to make of that. Uh, you know, when I was making the wheelie tutorial video, I was like, man, there's so many people that are better than me, you know? Why, why would I be qualified to tell other people how to wheelie? But, I don't know. I guess I'm not that bad. They're just people who are better. Mm. Whataburger's overrated, guys. If you ever come to Texas and you're excited about Whataburger, it's just alright. They don't have the best burgers. I like Dairy Queen more, actually. But Dairy Queen also never messes up my order. I feel like Whataburger, the best the best thing they could really do is just never get your order right and take absolutely forever for you to get it anyway. It's like, I've never quickly got my order from Whataburger like I can anywhere else. And I've never, uh, I've never been able to like change anything about my order and they actually get it right. Almost never. If you change like one meal, it might be alright, but if you have like multiple people ordering and you're like, and all of you ask for no onions, somebody's getting like mushrooms and jalapenos and you're still getting onions. And I don't even know how you, like, I, bro, I don't even know. But that's just how Whataburger is. Mm. Woo! For a solid, like, however long, probably like one or two seconds, it was just a constant sound. I didn't twitch it at all. Man, like I would never try again. Whoa, what are you doing, man? How you taking mine? The bike is so hot, it's burning my legs and my jeans. Gotta show the GoPro. My name. <laughs> That's so funny. My new scrape bar. Is it still there? It's still there. We'll see if it'll even st oh, stay in. It's probably going to take me a couple tries to actually scrape this thing. It's pretty far back there. I don't know if I scraped it. I heard a tink. Oh my gosh. That smacked down hard. Did I lose it? I lost it. Did I even touch it? Oh, I hit it twice? Did anybody get a video? In my mind, I did. <laughs> Bro, <I saw, laughs> that one smacked down hard. Oh my gosh, that was so funny. Yeah, I felt like that one dropped back really far. Yeah. yeah. Oh, I don't know why I didn't just pick it up. Oh wait, I was riding. There you go. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do very good on this thing. At least in this space, but I'll give it a shot. Maybe I'll just give it a shot on this this bigger road, and then I'll come back and try it. Oh snap! That is crazy looking stuff. All right, let's give it a shot. Oh yeah. I don't have my PSI is not super low, so. Should be all right. Oh, Wheelie and R1M. I don't think I ever expected this to this to be a thing I would do. Huh. 
Yeah, there's absolutely no chance that I'm going to be able to do this in that small lot. But uh, if they want to come watch it out here, it's not too bad. goodness boy this is an ex <laughs> gonna be an expensive fucking mistake if I mess up so I'm gonna do one more I'm gonna call it there because I uh, I don't got that kind of money This is not a lot bike, this is a this is a road bike. <laughs> Good golly bro. Who would have thought that I'd be Willie in an R1M? <laughs> oh my gosh! Yo! Yo, he just dipped back, bro, and he started going crazy. I gotta get rid of the wobbles, because I'm, like, wobbling hard. Yeah, you might need to drop your PSI a little bit. Oh, okay, okay. Well, it kind of depends. I mean, when I'm on your bike, I don't wobble, but... This one's at 40. 40? 40. Well, I was like, shit. Uh, can I try it? Yeah. I'll, see if I, I'll see if I wobble. If I wobble, then I would definitely say... You know it's high. Yeah. Let's see, let's see if I wobble. What the fuck? What the fuck? It just pulled your wheel out of alignment and knocked the chain off. What? Is that oh, what the hell? So it, oh, so that side looked like this with this plate up here, right? Yeah, that's the alignment. So it just broke it right off. What the hell, bro? I can't catch a goddamn break. <laughs> <laughs> oh snap, bro. My bro, that is mega suck. Why did it have to happen right as I hopped on?